Hey guys, this is Liam and Dylan Reznikov, owners of VT1 Gym, we're the creators of the Core MMA system. Uh, Dylan here is World Muay Thai Champion in 2009, um, and I'm Jiu Jitsu Black Belt and coach of the MMA team over here. Um, so guys, what we're showing you today is how to put your strikes together with your clinching. So Dylan's going to show some of his specialties. Now, I know this stuff works because as brothers we used to go and try everything out on each other, and I used to think I'm a wrestler, I'm going to smash this guy. Well, Unfortunately, this uh, does fall on my single legs and takedowns and ends up with me getting kneed. So, Dylan used to do this to me all the time. So, I can guarantee this works. Okay, guys, so what I'm going to do, I often see in the UFC and MMA fights, guys' kicks getting caught and they're getting swept and taken to the ground. And a lot of people are actually scared to kick in MMA. So, I'm going to show you a little movie, little trick of mine that does work. Okay, guys? And when you get your kick caught, it's a really, really good defense move, okay, which actually puts you in an offensive position. So I'll show you what we're going to do. I'm going to throw a kick with my left leg, okay, and they're going to catch it. When they catch it, you've got to be real quick, and this comes from practicing, practicing for hours and hours. Straight away, I want to put my shin across his, his quads. First thing this does is stops him from kneeing me. But you have to get control as well. So you've got to be careful that punch. I grab the arm, I lock it up, okay, and I grab the back of the head. Now, even if Liam stands up straight, okay, guys, what you want to do is you want to separate the head from the hips. And what happens from that when you do that? So I push my shin across, so I'm pushing against it, and I pull the head. Now, for Liam to lift me, it's going to put a lot of pressure in his lower back. And I maintain this. It's very hard for them to lift up. It's very a lot of people say, "Oh, you can get thrown and dumped in your head." It's really hard to pick me up. He's got some advanced tricks for that, but we'll go just to, we'll, we'll show them on a different video. From this, guys, what I want to do is because I got so much weight that I'm about to push down, and he's got so much pressure in his lower back. Straight away, I want to shove my leg down, even though he's caught. He's got a cord here. My leg's a lot stronger than his grip. Right now, he's focusing, trying to get his posture up, and I'm holding back. I pull my leg to the ground and go straight to clinch. From there, I can knee, etc. Okay, guys, it's a really cool trick. So you're doing a fast motion. It does. It puts a lot of pressure on your back. Try with one of your partners. So watch it. I kick, bang, straight away, knee across, and grab. And now, if they are standing up straight, which they will be, I pull and push from here straight to clinch. Bang. Okay, and elbow, etc. Again, okay, from here you can also take down. Okay. So guys, that's one of Dylan's little tricks. He's got a lot of follow-ups for how to stop getting foot swept and stuff, but I think uh, that one will uh, serve you guys well for a while, and we'll see you on the next video.